Following the commands He puts on your heart is the third point to follow God's plan in your life. One of the many ways to worship and glorify God is through obedience. Living in obedience is a great way to show your love and respect to Him. Isaiah 1.19 tells us that if you are willing and obedient, you will eat the best of the land. God without obeying Him and His Word. Let's commit to obey Him with a heartfelt love and show an appreciation for all the things He has done for us. We serve a big, magnificent, awesome God. To start the year right, let's obey Him immediately and wholeheartedly so we can walk with Him closely and enjoy the benefits of our obedience. Have a prosperous and Christ-centered new year. Remember, loving God means doing what He tells us to do. Happy New Year! To God be all the glory! My greatest blessing after I obey God is yung peace o yung kapayapaan. Most especially nung sinubok ko ng Lord sa isang sitwasyon na kung saan kailangan ko talagang sumunod. And after that, nung nakasunod ako, God gave me the peace of mind and the peace sa buong aspeto ng aking. Ako naman, Ate Rizzi, uh, before I am a grasshopper Christian. No, yung uh, kung saan ka may invite, doon ko para sa akin na nararamdaman no, na there is the, the blessing of God to me. Pero nung uh, nakapag-attend ako dito sa KRM and I followed God to remain and to bloom where I am planted, doon ko na-receive yung uh, uh, peace and uh, of course yung uh, biyaya din kapag uh, nakakatugon ka doon sa commitment mo sa panamba. Salvation by far is the best gift a person can receive. Teacher Sheila Williams. Sige po, tayo po yung buko at manalangin. Amang Diyos, maraming salamat po sa magkakataw nito. Ako po ngayon ay lumalapit at nagpapakumbaba sa inyong harapan. Patawarin po ninyo ako sa lahat ng aking mga nagawang kasalanan sa isip, sa salita, at sa gawa. Sa oras kong ito, tinatanggap kita bilang aking Panginoon at sariling tagapagligtas ng aking buhay. Puspusin po ninyo ako ng inyong santong espiritu at kabananan. Kayo na nga po ang siyang masunod sa lahat ng aking mga gagawin at sa lahat ng aking mga plan. Isulat po ninyo ang aking pangalan ng pinin po natin ang ating mga pangalan sa Sheila S. Marin sa aklat ng buhay. In Jesus' name, Amen. And for the declaration, Matt Milton. All together, let us declare as we say, by the power of the blood of Jesus, we are all COVID-19 free. Coronavirus is already defeated, folks. No weapon for us or prosper and we will enjoy each day of our lives. No way that we have done. In Jesus' name, Amen. Thank you for the usual support, people liking and subscribing. Keep in mind that true success is obeying God. This is Our Vibes Life Sense.
Let's go comments.